Painesville is about an hour and a half northwest of Minneapolis. There is one pharmacy that lines its main street and about 600 people could get vaccinated there if it had any doses. Oh yeah, and it's killing me that I can't help him by vaccinating him right now. When he can, longtime pharmacist Lee Landsteiner loyally serves this entire community, known for its good fishing and cheese plan. Yeah, I mean, you really get to know, they become like family. Lee is making it his mission to get the vaccine here, but the family-owned shop isn't part of the federal partnership program, plus the short supply means he'll wait at least another week. When it happens, he's prioritizing local people at high risk who might already be at a disadvantage. Somebody from two hours away can come in and get that appointment that has access to a computer that holds know-how rather than that elderly patient that maybe doesn't have doesn't know how to set up that appointment online. Local pharmacies can control who gets an appointment first and will take the time to phone or make house calls to patients. So as Lee says, they don't fall through the cracks. Minnesota is expected to get about 304,000 doses next week, twice as much as this week. And maybe then it won't be long before Lee Landsteiner can go back to doing what he does best, helping the whole town. Somewhere down the road when we feel like we've offered those appointments to the people most at risk, then we'll have to open it up. There are some other options for the people of Painesville to get a vaccine if they're a patient at the local hospital or if they want to drive to the pharmacy in Cold Spring or St. Cloud, which are both about a half an hour away. In Painesville, Jennifer Hoff, CARE 11 News.